Fulani taminga ngaro ni kito Animo endemi karo ni kito The Madagascar Fauna and Flora Group, a consortium of about 20 zoos, botanical gardens, and aquariums all over the world, was founded in 1988. In 2013, the MFG celebrates the 25th anniversary of their activities in Park Evoluina and in the natural reserve of Bay Tampana near Tuamasana in the northeast of Madagascar. Their specialty is their holistic approach. Their four main activities, conservation, research, capacity building, and environmental education are closely interconnected. 100% of the Malagasy lemurs are endemic, but 91% of them figure on the red list of the International Union for Conservation of Nature due to the degradation of their habitat and the hunting pressure. MFG concentrates on breeding endangered animals for which there are national and international programs. More than 100 lemurs of 12 species are living in the park. Three diurnal lemurs are critically endangered. The blue-eyed black lemur, the greater bamboo lemur, and the black and white roughed lemur. We are in the same way. We are in the same reserve natural and integral and bitampo. Dia if a misfia tsarana ni population varkantanga ze misatifa le after tea and park zoologique ze misatifa de nyarka tam le sauvage. Bernard, director of the park, grew up close to Bay Tampan. Inspired by this environment, he studied botany. He has been working for the MFG for 16 years. Zonatini ala nakrea de ma fantatui i tia kakazu zon fina nanaz. Zone of Mosien, Refam Terkan, Varkandanga, the Mano Tangu and Buni Akakas. The colored collars help to identify and track them to see, for example, if an individual is not with his group. The park is also home to three nocturnal lemurs the tiny mouse lemur, the greater dwarf lemur, and the eye eye, which Malagasy consider a bad omen. Tengah saya mesti lihat ramai asam ni resam pirine ni zani, nam fanza kangi, nam ni organis mautan ni park zoologika apa. Only about 500 individuals of the pro lemur simus are still in the wild, plus a captive population in six European zoos and one in Park Evoluina. Since 2009, they are all integrated into the European breeding program, the EEP. The MFG and the European zoos exchanged greater bamboo lemurs to improve genetic diversity of their populations. It was a good match between Bekili from Paris and Tethys from London, both transferred to Park Evoluina. And in October 2012, Bakili gave birth to her first baby. Four of the five endemic tortoises are critically endangered, such as the radiated and the spider tortoises from the south of Madagascar. Although it is illegal, they are still captured for their meat and shell or the pet market. <laughs> The forestry station of Park Evoluina extends over almost 700 acres of secondary forest and is home to more than 75 species of endemic plants. The station also serves to test different methods for the restoration of endemic plants which are threatened by extinction. Mami is at the same time directing the forestry station and the conservation training center. <laughs> Le volo on y a une recherche conservation là ni fitatine ni cette safaroua ni recherche ni cette safatéloi d'une recherche entretien ni infrastructure à ton administration d'une farine une recherche valorisation. In the Bay Tampana Natural Reserve, the researchers found 18 species of endemic plants, which are found nowhere else in the world. 
Jean-Francois, the tree nursery specialist, is also the chief of Ambunivatu, a village benefiting from the program of the Madagascar Fauna and Flora Group. Botanists from Missouri Botanical Garden and MFG search for trees in bloom in the forest and continuously monitor them to collect their seeds. The seeds are treated and the seedlings put in pots. During the reforestation campaign, they are planted in the forestry station and around Betampana Natural Reserve. Precious woods such as ebony and rosewood are sold abroad for astronomic sums. In 2009 alone, 60,000 trees were cut in protected areas. This corresponds to almost 25,000 acres of primary forest. The tindaka zany dalberzia. Dalberzia ty zany azo nivokarana teto ivolona ihany zany eto zany misy fototra ny dalberzia. Fotsona fa crise zany misy mitana tany reserve. De le famezana ny io le foko olo ny mitana tany reserve de iny zany tena olo ana matetika mitranga amin'ny MFG works with about 400 villagers to plant native rainforest tree species on their own land around the reserve to create a zone of protection. To date, almost 42,000 trees covering 310 acres have been planted during the four restoration phases. The fifth phase started in April 2013. <laughs> The Madagascar Fauna and Flora Group not only plants trees but also offers training in ecologically sound agricultural techniques to farmers in the Ivaluna and Bay Tampana landscapes. In the model farm at the park, visiting farmers are trained in improved rice growing techniques, cultivation on slopes, and composting methods. Often the soil suffers from erosion due to the slash and burn practices, and it's difficult to cultivate. For this reason, the farmers also learn how to make compost. A garden with herbs and medical plants complete the model farm. Capacity building of the local population and offering them a place where they can exchange their environmental experiences this is one of the objectives of the Madagascar Fauna and Flora Group. A very important branch is environmental education. Its target is to train young people to become green ambassadors within their families and schools. The Environmental Education Center in Park Ivaluna is directed by Nirin. 
satria le fampenana zany ny eritreritra ny tsara kamisara ka sady manao education environnemental no manatsara ihany koa ny fianarana ity mba azahoana vokatra ao anatiny izay zany tena mampiavaka ny Madagasikara ka na ny flora dito anatiny education atony tsy mandeha fotsy ny hoe mianatra ny classe fotsy fa tena misy lalao mandeha mivoaka mandeha mitsangatsangana mandeha sur terrain mitsy zareo dia manao activité pratique By using marbles, Flavien, one of the instructors, shows how trees protect the soil against erosion. Ita zany fomba mbiazana ho anatin'ny le izy le fanabiazana tao de anisan'ny ohatra lehibe amin'ny satria fa nanomboka tamin'ny 1996 ny aktivité ny ekôly samedi. The Saturday school combines theory in the classroom with practical exercises and games. The topic of the day is recycling and reducing the garbage. Dia naikkan ni semua, ariu le piara miasa piara membunat ke dia naikkan zariwa, na parita ke mana dalam misi sita eva terzawa, nun naikkan ini sepo terlan raya ni aktiviti dia naton parita ke ni aktiviti. And according to Cisco School Authority, the environmental education offered by the Madagascar Fauna and Flora Group is a perfect complement to the education children receive at school. The pass rates of the school exam are usually 45% in this area, but those pupils having passed through the Saturday school achieve between 85 and 100%. MFG currently runs Saturday school in four sites and has plans to open a fifth site in the fall of 2013 to reach even more children. Ini farfai zaman 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 lakukan so di sini anda lihat anak kereta nak mafu nak jalan di tempat nak tuh di. Tema novel zau, us baku 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 tema novel zau, tema novel zau.